East Harlem Young Women's Clinic was founded to promote a healthy community by providing young women with education and access to basic gynecological care. Specifically targeted towards women in their teens and 20s, the clinic provides both group education and free individual medical care for the young women of East Harlem. Uninsured young women can use the clinic for routine gynecological exams, pap smears, HPV, STI, and pregnancy testing, contraception prescriptions, options counseling, and abortions. The clinic provides referrals to specialists when needed, with detailed information about costs. Group sessions on relevant health, health topics are open to all young women in the community and cover topics such as STI prevention, contraception options, the importance of basic gynecological care, and pregnancy planning. We put a lot of thought into um, the location of our clinic. Um, we wanted to uh, focus on an area that needed help and uh, East Harlem seemed like an ideal choice. First of all, um, East Harlem has a younger population. The area is predominantly Black and Hispanic. Um, both populations which have been uh, underserved historically. A large percentage of the population of the area lives in poverty and because of this many people don't have health insurance. The condom use um, in East Harlem is much lower than the rest of New York City and for this reason um, we do offer free contraception. The clinic partners with CUNY Hunter's Silberman School of Social Work, School of Public Health, and the Undergraduate Nursing Program to obtain volunteer staff with relevant experience. Located just a few blocks from the 119th Street campus, the clinic is not only in the heart of East Harlem, but also in a convenient location for volunteers. Our partnership with CUNY Hunter enables us to provide free care as well as ensure our staffing needs are always met. Funds for the operation of the clinic are obtained through generous grants and donations. We're fortunate and thankful for support from the public, private, and nonprofit sector. The clinic is run by a board with a variety of different members, and there's always a minimum of one experienced physician on staff, um, and they oversee the operations within the clinic. All volunteer staff from Hunter make up at least one third of the board, and volunteer community members who serve as health educators and work on outreach also make up one third of the board. The board makes decisions about the um, operation of the clinic and we always strive to make unanimous decisions. We believe that to educate these people can ultimately save their lives. <laughs>